and welcome. My name is Luisa Winters and I am a certified instructor for Adobe Photoshop. In this podcast, I'd like to go over how to use the Content Aware Scale, which is new in Photoshop CS4. Let me go ahead and talk about this picture a little bit. We have here the picture of a boy on the beach and uh, uh, it needs to be as wide as the canvas. If I use the free transform, let me go ahead and do that, which is Command T, the boy also gets stretched, so we can't have that. I'm gonna go ahead and undo that, which is Command or Control Z. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna make use of the Content Aware Scale. Edit, Content Aware Scale, and all I have to do now is stretch the picture, and as you can see, the water stretches, but the boy does not. We have a perfect fit of the boy uh, in the canvas. However, this doesn't always work. So let me go ahead and close this image. Let's see this one right here, which is a picture of these two boys in front of the Brookfield uh, Zoo uh, entrance. And let's go ahead and use exactly the same technique. Edit, Content Aware Scale. I'm gonna go ahead and stretch the image, just like what I did before. It is obvious that this does not work. So I'm gonna go ahead and commit to that and then undo. What I need to do with this is I need to create a mask so that I can tell Photoshop which areas of the picture to protect. So let me go ahead and do that. For that, I'm gonna create a new layer and I'll do that by clicking on the new layer icon here at the bottom. And on this new layer, I am going to paint with white. I'm going to paint on top of the boys, paint here. Notice that I'm painting on the new layer. Paint on this boy as well. And I'll paint on the lion just for good luck. Perfect. Now I'm going to create yet another layer and I'm gonna place it behind or under the layer with the white paint. Edit, fill, and I'm gonna use black because I want that grayscale image of the white and the black as you can see here. Now I'm gonna to go to the channels panel. I'll select any of the channels, it doesn't really matter because it's a grayscale image. Right click any of the ones, duplicate channel, click OK, and now let's go back to RGB. After I have that channel saved, I can delete those two layers that I just created. So select them, click on the little trash can here at the bottom, and there you go. All I have to do now is go Edit, Content Aware Scale, and up here where it says Protect, I'm going to select the new channel that I created. That's all I have to do. I stretch the image. It does its thing. I'll commit to it. And there you have it. It's a perfect stretch and none of the boys got stretched.